Okay, sorry, my camera quit on me for some reason. So, it came with three brushes, which I thought was really nice. This was a, a $20 set, and their brushes can be pretty expensive. So, it came with a face brush, an eye kabuki, and a blush brush. And they're, they're pretty blunt on the ends, which I like because it picks up a lot of color when they're blunt like that. And it also came with um, blush. It's called Naughty Naughty. And it's very pinkish, mauvish, sparkly, which I like those kind of colors. And it came with Magnetize Eye Color, which is... I haven't opened this one yet. It's a greenish, um, almost pea color. Um, I'm not one for greens really, but I'll try that. And another one called Kudos Eye Color. And it's it's really pretty. It's like a shimmery tan color. And it also came with... the Pure Radiance and Tropical Mate Radiance Bare Minerals All Over Face Color. And there's two different colors of radiance in there. And they're really sparkly and shimmery. Gives you a nice um, glow and sparkle to your face. I just get it, got it all over the disc. And so that was that kit. And then I also got the Bare Minerals Hollywood Glamour kit that came with, it's a four piece collection, but it came with Magic Wand Brushless Mascara, and I didn't think this stuff was going to be very good, but it actually is really neat. I've never seen anything like it, but if you look at the brush, there are no bristles. It's, it's all flat, and it's all just in the stick, there's little ridges, and it actually lengthens your lashes a lot. Um, I tried it yesterday and it worked really well. So I'm actually really happy with that. And then it came with um, eye color and humor which is like a dark green color and eye color and high style which is a, a beige pinkish color. Looks like that. And it also came with an eye color called Snazzy, which is like a brown mauve pretty color. Um, one of them came with a tinted mineral veil. Um, one of these kits that I bought, I don't remember. Oh, the Pure Moxie kit came with a tinted mineral veil, so that was a nice addition. And then the last thing I got, or last few things I got, was the ID Bare Minerals Compact Quad 2 Liner Shadow. And this was only $6.50 and it was usually $24. So I thought it was a good deal since I never really bought um, Bare Minerals makeup before. But you open it and it has these little... Um, wells that you can take the liner brush and you can dip it in and pull out some color and you can put it in here and do it dry or you can pull out some color and add some water and do it wet to make a wet liner so I really think these are neat um, I would like to get more eyeshadows which you can you can still use this as a shadow also but I would like to get more eyeshadow sets like this instead of in these little jars because I'm not necessarily hooked on Bare Minerals like I thought I might be after buying my first products, which these were my first, because of how messy they can be and get all over. Um, and I don't really like that. But um, I like that you can just dip your brush in here and it has these little plugs to keep the product from going all over. 
So that's a very neat little kit. And it's one of my, actually one of my favorite things that I bought from there. We have Aquamarine Color, Coffee Bean, Firefly, and Retro. And the back of it looks like this, so you can see through it. But that was all I got. Oh, and I bought the Quick Change Brush Cleaner. So, um, I thought that was a neat way to clean your brushes real quick in between um, putting on your makeup day to day or if you notice your brush is getting a lot of shadow or something on it, that's a quick way to, to get rid of it. Um, and then just to show you some things that I have bought recently. I did visit Ulta yesterday, and they have these really cute pink bags now for Breast Cancer Awareness Month, instead of the orange. And they have this really cute palette in the clearance section, and it's Ulta brand. It's called Irresistible Eyes, and it's a water-resistant eyeshadow palette, and you get eight. But I loved the colors that were in it. I thought they were just really, really pretty. Um... So we have Naked, Sunset Strip, Gold Rush, Coral Glow, Bloom, Trendsetter, Deep Sea, and Ink. So those were really pretty colors, and for $6.50, I thought that was a really, really good deal. Um, this was only like a $1.39 in clearance. It's Rose Lip Gloss um, by NYC, and it's just really pretty rose color, and has a rose on it, and you, you can just dip your brush in it and try it out. And two other clearance things. They had a Recover Anti-Fatigue Concealer from Rimmel. Uh, I think I paid like a dollar or something for that, just to try it. And Vinyl Bronze Mirror Shine Lip Gloss that was only like a dollar thirty-nine. And Bronze Ambition from Rimmel. So, that's a really pretty shimmery bronzy color. So, dollar thirty-nine. And the last thing, um, with their 21 Days of Beauty, they have little things on sale every day. Um, and so this was a Tarte Lock and Roll 12 Hour Eyeshadow, and it was only $8. And they're usually, I think, close to 20 so I thought it was a good deal to try. And it has two ends. You have the loose powder end that rolls on your eye, and then you have the cream end that you can put this on first and then put the loose powder on. But they're really pretty and I, um, when I swatched it on my hand it showed up really pretty and creamy. And this is the color Quartz, which is like a faint rose and gold color. So I was really happy to try that. And then just some things that I had bought recently. Um, this little Caboodles case from Walmart was clearance to like maybe five dollars but I was using it to put um, makeup in that I use every day instead of having to get it out and one of the MAC things that I bought from the CCO down in Tennessee was the Hocus Pocus colorful face kit with two beauty powders and a shimmer blush and peachy keen um, the two beauty powders are sun sparked pearl and pretty baby but I loved the case and I loved the two powders that were inside. And then this little thing slides over for the blush. And those colors are just perfect for me. I wear a lot of pinks and nude type colors. And this is probably the most pricey MAC thing I've bought for myself. Um, I don't have a lot of MAC items and these were the first things that I bought. So this was the first thing of MAC that I bought at the CCO down there. And I also bought, I love this, the Tartan eyeshadow, A Wish Come True. And it's the the pink Tartan um, pattern. There's lots of other colors, but like I said, I wear pink a lot. So that was basically my first uh, MAC eyeshadow that I bought for myself. I don't have a lot of MAC items. Um, two other favorites that I have in here. Shadow Insurance and Candlelight by Too Faced. Um, never used to wear primer, but um, tried this when they I had a coupon for three fifty off ten dollars, so I tried it and I loved it. And then we have the Too Faced Shadow Insurance, just the regular, 
And this I got when Alta had their 